to uh, easiest way to create a sidebar menu so let's start just create a single view application from the xcode go next just give one name as a menu click next uh, give the storing position where we want to save this just go to the main storyboard so what we are going to do here just we are going to take two containers view one is for the left portion another one is for the right portion so just drag and drop to container views uh, this is the one container view fill horizontally fill vertically this is the one container view and this is the view controller for that container view just uh, add the constraint for that that's fine and we need to take the layout of this constraint so just go here and uh, create a IB outlet just give as a left space that's fine okay it looks good now add one more container to this view mm, to drag and drop that container here just resize that and put the vertical position that's fine uh, this is coming apart just uh, change the hierarchy okay it looks fine now add the constraint for this one top left bottom and uh, width we can fix that's it it's done now add the this one table view for this left container so i'm adding the table view for that resize the table view horizontally and vertically and add one table view cell for that okay it's done give some cell identifier cell i am keeping as a cell that's done this all stuff is done okay okay this is done okay fine now let's create some classes for this list and detail so just i am going here and creating one uh, new class go next just take a ui touch cocoa touch class and inherit from ui view controller give the name as a list view controller that's fine now click on next and create just associate that class to this list menu okay it's done now we'll add some data source for this and just i'm changing the color of this one so that will give us a little differentiation between the two controllers we can keep as black it's looking not good just keep this color okay fine now we can define the data source and delegate methods here so give some extension and uh, list view controller UI table view data source and uh, just add these two methods so we need number of rows in section and we need to define one cell so as we can define one array here let's say titles and 
give some name like one and two and three just return the count of this array dot titles dot count that's fine now create one cell here table view dot tq reusable cell identifier and cell whatever name we have given to the storyboard and this index path return cell this looks good okay it's done it will return the title now we can do some stuff here okay so one thing we forgot to add here we need to add some navigation bar to this so that we can add some left bar button or something so just add this go here embed one navigation controller scheme up navigation controller oh it's overlapping to our container so we need to reduce our containers height pick this container and reduce the height as this much and pick this container and reduce the height of this as well okay now it's good now update the constraint okay so better what we can do is update the constraint okay or we can change the priority for this constraint as well okay anyway it's not going to affect uh, just for demo purpose uh, we can keep it as it is now let's uh, add one button left to corner so take one button and add this here and give some significant image to that okay so where we can find the image mm, add contact no something different we can give a image just add as undo not it's not looking good give some kind of it's looking good this we can keep just like this and we need to add one action for that so add one action just right click over there and add selector and drag and drop give some so menu that's it done now let's add some code over there so whenever this menu will click what we need to do just we need to shift the left space to the whatever width of this small container so let's check it what is the width of this small container that is 155 so just what we need to do okay so we can put here one case if self dot left space dot constant equals equals to zero if that is zero then we need to show the list then self dot left space dot constant equals to one double five else we can set it again to zero okay now let's test this is it working or not
okay oh it's coming it's coming but it's not displaying any data so let's uh, add title because we forget to set the titles here cell dot text label dot title equals to self dot titles and uh, give the index path dot row okay it's done so now it will display one two three and let's see so as you can see it's coming too fast so we can reduce this uh, we can add some animation for that uh, just go to the list view and here and just add some animation for this just use ui view dot animate with duration just give some interval for that just 0 0.3 and uh, do self dot view dot dot self dot view dot layout subviews uh, layout if needed now let's run oh, it's working or not wow it's looking pretty much good so this is the easiest way for creating a left bar menu. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Just do like the video. Thank you so much. We'll see you in the next session.